Well guys, welcome to our Thursday morning. We are getting ready. I gotta go over there and get some fuel for my truck and reefer. I'm not sure if this next load is actually a reefer load, but we're down to a half a tank, so I figure I better feel it, right? I better feel it. I figure I better feel it. But good morning, everybody. Welcome to our fantastic super day. It's a little overcast, but you know what? We get to go somewhere. <laughs> we get to go pick up a load. And uh, I told you guys I would tell you on yesterday's video where we were going to go in, uh, in South Dakota. Well, we're picking up in Easton, Maryland. That's going to be interesting because it's not off the interstate. Not a bit. It's kind of like, if you know how Maryland is shaped, well, well, if you take 50, you cross this big bottle of body of water, right? And uh, on the other side is uh, Washington. So straight west from where I'm picking up, if you took 50, what is that, Arlington or something? But if you take 50 and go straight west, you run right into Washington, D.C. So we're going to be between that body of water, whatever it is, because it ain't telling me. And uh, just like you guys been to them trips where I went to Delaware and picked up my load. It's between that and that body of water. We're, we're kind of, we won't be in Delaware though, but we'll be in Maryland. So it's, it's just a little narrow uh, 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 strip of uh, real estate that we're going to be traveling through. And, uh, and that's where we're picking up the load. We are actually only, let me turn around on real quick. I think it said 100 and well Google says 134 Rhonda is saying 164 so Rhonda's a, tr a truck GPS and she's actually up to date now oh yeah absolutely I, I guess I wasn't doing it right and Rudy me and Rudy was talking and he was talking about he said well mine usually has 300 updates when mine's only got 70 you know and he was telling me things just like really so now it's, she's not as dumb as uh, as we think she is because we actually have her, <laughs> we actually got her updated right. Uh, 162, three hours and 12 minutes. So, and it's uh, 9.01, 9, 10, 11, 12. We'll be there about 12, give or take. And uh, we got to five to get there. So we'll, we'll have plenty of time. And then I got to run through Elkhart because my driver's license expires uh well on the 22nd and today is the the 11th so 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 21 2. got 11 more days and my driver's license expires so i gotta get through elkhart and uh i have to renew my license but no problem just gotta get through there so if i can get through there on friday i pick up this load i'm gonna hammer down hard and if i can get through there friday if not saturday because I know the license branch is open a half a day on Saturday. So, if I can't get through there Friday, I'll have to spend a night and do it Saturday morning. But I, I just got to renew my license. But anyway, we're going to go down there. We're going to get some fuel and uh, and then take off. Uh, I need that to help me get out. Plus, I got a few receipts right here with me. And I'm hoping that might help me get out. I didn't spend that much money here. And uh, I went over there to got that hamburger at Love's. So I can't use that receipt, right? I was at a different location. Uh, that was my, that's another receipt. Plus I got these two receipts. So I'm kind of hoping that might help me. Not that I can't pay cash, but if I don't want to, if I don't have to, because I did spend some money here. That should be one day right there. My fuel should be two. So, and I've only, been here two full days so this should help me get out of there but anyway let's get our day going here thank you for following and uh, hope hopefully i'm giving you justice this is my daily life this is what i'm doing so hopefully you guys like it we'll be right back all right now let me make sure i'm not moving so let's just there we go. Get the camera at the right height there. Okay. We got a 
Well, we gotta go right before we go left because the, the way the truck is angled here in the parking lot. But we gotta roll down here, get some fuel. Well, I'm like you barely from a half a tank, but where I'm going, there's not really, there's no place to fuel. And I ain't going to, to the Baltimore TA, that's a fact. I hate that place. That's an accident to be waiting for. We're just gonna come up here, make our Yui. As soon as this truck decides where he's going, where's he going? Okay. We'll go down there and get our fuel. on the driving line already I get down here I got to show fuel yeah you did barely move our trucks now because they updated our uh, our uh, log books I just barely started moving it's already got me on the driving line as soon as I hit this fuel island I'm gonna have to uh, Here's the thing though, I gotta pick one that this Warner driver is not even fueling up. And I can't block block block. Sorry about that. The skill, he's already blocking the skill. I'm gonna be blocking the skill too. I'll just get behind Martin. He ain't fueling neither. He just came out here. I just shut the camera off too, so he just came out here and stuck the hose in his uh, tank. So that's good. Maybe he won't be much longer. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Somebody walked by, saw the camera, and gave us a piece saying, I just didn't have the camera on. <laughs> oh, I thought that was neat. Now he just pulled up so he can get his reefer fuel. And, uh,. And don't worry guys, I am going to attack the window as soon as uh, we get up there and get our fuel. I'm going to put the uh, put the squeegee and try to get what few bug guts we got up there off. Right, let's get our fuel. And remember, we can get a free shower, too. A free shower. That'll come handy today, somewhere, maybe, or tomorrow. Me both. Remember how we did this before, guys? I don't need death this time. Skip the death. Take one, two, A. No purchase order. Trailer six, four, one, zero. No cash advance. No product. 139101 Trip zero. I don't even know if that mileage went in there right. I think one of them numbers hit twice. Is it authorizing? Oh, yep, yep. We can get our fuel now. Get my gloves put on. All right, I'm gonna put you back here. You guys watch everything for me. All right. 
go to the other side, get our fuel. I'm, I'm just going to fill it up. That way I don't have to worry about it. I don't know where I'm going to set you guys here. I guess I'll just set you right there. See if I can use the squeegee. See if there's. See, that's the problem. That's what I ran into that one time. You guys saw me started to do my windows. There was no. Oh, there is in here though. All right, cool. Shut you guys right here. Hey, do me a favor and don't fall. There's a place I could put you on the other side, but I don't know if you actually saw that on that side, but uh, no, oh, it's done. All right, let's go hang up the pumps. <laughs> he moved, so we can actually get our reefer fuel.
got to pull up get my receipt i was thinking i didn't have to but that's gonna help me get out of here watch out guys watch out look out yeah that's gonna help me get out of here right so i gotta get that so i'm just gonna pull up i don't need nothing but the receipt so hopefully that's not gonna be a long line well we got our fuel we're good in that department guys I gotta go get our fuel fuel receipt oh she gonna ask me what pump that was I guarantee six five four yeah. I gotta walk over there. I forgot what pump that was. I'll wait, I'll wait till he moves up. Four. I think that's seven. Yeah, it's pump two. It's pump two. Because then you gotta tell him what pump. That's the only way they know who you are. So, out of courtesy and respect, we'll be right back. I meant that because I didn't, you know, not everybody likes to be on video. If somebody says, hey, I know who you are, and they want to be on video, that's one thing. But I don't deliberately ever try to put anybody on video unless they want to be. So, out of just sure respect, that's why I did what I did. But anyway... Let's get on the road. We got everything we need. We should be able to get out of here. Hopefully. Watch out, guys. Watch out, boys. Watch out. We gotta go. We gotta go. <laughs> we'll be right back. and take that over to 
what is that four four ninety five I think that would be four ninety five that goes around uh, DC and probably take two seventy and take that up toward eighty one. I'll show you. Then we'll take 70 across to 68. We've been on on that road many a time. And stay on 68 to 79 and, and take uh, uh, 70. But first things first, we gotta get down here and pick up our load. We're 2.6 miles from Main Street. We gotta turn right on Main Street. To slide our axles back too but I want the uh, air to build up a tiny bit we don't need a reefer on for this one and uh, I'm only 8,000 pounds let's see there we go oh I'm all the way to the doors nothing's coming out what do we got here? Barrier film. Oh wow. Pretty cool. I still don't really know what it is. <laughs> 3M. Okay. Oh, come on. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. We out of here. We got our load. It delivers on Monday. We got to make one pit stop. And that's uh, in Elkhart because I got to renew my driver's license. So, let's get out of here. I am 1,384 miles away. It's going to take us 23 hours and 6 minutes to run our, to run our trip. That's without the detour, of course. Oh. Did I not slide? Okay, wait a minute. I gotta do one thing yet. All right, we're getting off and going 81 North. <coughs> we'll take this to, I think it's 5B, exit 5B. <coughs> and I hope there's a spot in there for me to park, cause I'm hungry. You know me, I get hungry. I. I talk about it a lot. All right, we're in Hagerstown. Now I'm gonna go in and have me a, a fried chicken dinner. 
Oh yeah! Whew, I'm hungry. <laughs> I'll be right back. There's my food, y'all. See that? Fried potatoes, or new potatoes, fried chicken, and that's cream spinach, a roll, and a chocolate milk. We're going to eat, and we'll be right back. Well, guys, it is the next day, and we're sitting here in Hagerstown. Yep, we're up. We're having our coffee. Yeah, the doggies are saying good morning to me. Come here. You gonna say good morning to me? Come here. Come here. You just, where you going, Panda? <laughs> We're gonna get ready to go. I'm gonna take these guys out real quick. Let them do their thing. Somebody asked me how often I take them out. Yep. About every two, three hours they go out. Unless we're setting, then they get to go out for a long time. We go out for long walks. Yeah. But I don't keep them cooped up in my truck. I just want to make that clear. Because I would not. That that would be like gel, you know. We don't like gel, don't we? We don't like gel. No, we don't like gel. We really don't. <laughs> but anyway. Uh, we're going to go ahead and hang this video up. So we can show you what we're going to do uh, today. And uh, I hope you guys like our videos. I really do. I really do um you know because we're going to continue showing you whatever it just i want to thank you i really do and uh with that being said we'll see you guys tomorrow morning with another video god bless if you're not subscribed hit the subscribe button don't forget to give us a thumbs up and please share them and we'll talk to you guys on the next video until then, later.